Hey, Jason Satterland here. So we've shot some really cool behind the scenes stuff on this next little video. Um, but unfortunately there was generators going and all kinds of noise and crap. So you can't really hear what I'm saying. So this video is gonna be closed captioned for the hearing impaired. Hey, Jason I'm Jason Satterland. Satterland. We're doing a bunch of weather effects. We're doing some wind, we're doing some rain. We tried to use the Movi. It's a stabilizing device for cameras. You hold it just like this. A couple things we learned. What you're gonna wanna do is you gotta make sure that you gotta have some prep time. It's not just some sort of stabilizing unit that you can just pick up and go. Our prep guys, it took us 10 hours. 10 hours. Hey there, so I'm here to picture this in Portland, Oregon. I'm here with my friend Will, and we got the Moby set up right here. And uh, we used it on a shoot, it was really pretty amazing. A um, couple things that we ran into, we tried to put uh, one of those spinning rain deflectors on here. Whoops didn't work. Um, we had to end up bagging the entire system, which made it kind of interesting to use. We use the C300. Yeah. Um, you can use an Epic on here. Uh -huh. What cameras would you recommend using? What, what we've been seeing, most popular are certainly the Red Epics and Red Scarlets. Next, C300s, uh, we had a C500 on here, C100s, uh, all those Canon uh, line of cameras have been really popular on here, as well as DSLRs have been very popular to fly. Some of the cameras that we have been unable to balance or it's been very difficult to balance uh, would be the Sony FS700 and the Sony F5. Uh, both of those cameras are under the weight limit, but they're just so awkward uh, and long. For instance, the FS700 is so long that the butt end of it uh, ends up hitting the back of the gimbal so that when you, uh, you try to tilt uh, up or down, when the movie tries to compensate for any uh, tilt movement, the back of the camera hits uh, the gimbal system. Uh, however, Freefly has stated that they're gonna be uh, coming out with the uh, extension kit uh, for the Moby M10 that'll basically lengthen these rods here and allow you to put some of those uh, more awkward cameras onto the Moby M10s. It's a great invention. I can't wait to see what other people do with it. I'm Jason Satterland. Thanks for watching and enjoy the weather. Um, to, uh, you can subscribe. You can click here. More movie videos are Um, if you remember the name Big Puddle Films, it's the same on Twitter and Facebook. <laughs>